Welcome to Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing, where you like, subscribe, and share on our way to 2 billion subscribers. Yes, that's right. Old Vincenzo just said 2 billion subscribers, right? You got to start somewhere. And uh, you like, subscribe, and share, and become a member of Jabronkos. Nah, yes, Jabronkos. So that way you can be educated about not only stocks, and bonds and commodities but oh yes that very important thing you have to be educated and have a high financial iq in modern times about money right if you don't understand what money is you're fucked the rich understand what money is the elite understand what money is how it works and how you make it work for you and generate cash flow right if you don't understand that, you're doomed before you started. You don't understand the battle and let alone be on the playing field in the war, right? If you don't understand the enemy, you shouldn't be on the playing field. You'll be demolished like Michigan against fucking Ohio State for 30 years. As you can see, Bitcoin in the background, the price pumped just like we forecasted. And now it's meeting upper resistance, multiple upper resistance. And I think it's going to dance up and down around here for the next maybe day or two before it finally starts to come down like you see in our target, right? Same thing with, let's run down the list real quick, Dogecoin. Everyone's favorite Dogecoin, my company building Dogecoin. And it did the same thing in Doge. We deciphered that out beautifully. Let's delete that nonsense. Remember when we drew this for you the other day? I deleted the lines, the moving averages that I was drawing out for you. But we deciphered and sniffed this out on a phenomenal call. Yesterday, down here, we drew out the hook nose Jewish bearish reversal pattern. And it came up at the top. And you can see that big candle wick as I zoom in. Oh, oh that's right, old Vincenzo says as he zooms in. Right, look at that, flawlessly zoomed in. See that big candle wick up there? Let's delete that. See that big candle wick and it touched that upper white line that's uh, descending? Uh, that big candle wick coming down to the base of the uh, body pour a little pointer tool out right y'all see that right now a big wick bam big wick in the 30 minute time frame that means heavy sell pressure and this is indeed as we suspected a major area of upper resistance and the sellers are lining up in this area and that is uh where the 200 day moving average is which would make sense in the hour time frame we're in the half hour time frame but in the hour time frame they're down here that's why we think we're getting rejected here. And we could come back up and dance. Oh, I'm making a wrong turn. Thinking I was on lunch, but actually my day is over at work. So the, we're just going to flip a quick Yui right quick. Right here. Right yonda. Turn that bitch back into drive and crisis averted. Just like the crises are averted on a daily basis for you, my beautiful, lovely going subscribers on Vincenzo's Go Crypto Investing where we give you simple, easy to understand steps to sidestep and audible the criminal gangster cartel, the yes, the Ohio State University, brother, right? You could do this and dance, pop off, and then you're going down, right? Or you could get rejected and immediately go down. Either way, you're coming way, way down in Dogecoin, just like the Dogecoin champion has been telling you for weeks, Dogecoin is bearish and for weeks, I've had the naysayers say, I don't see no fucking bearish shit. And then bam, right in the face, they get shot down at key support and resistance by the dual twins, Jabroni Killer, uh, and Isaac's personal favorite, Duck Hunter, right? Fucking every fucking time. And then every time I get these emails, right? So then I try to show you a different way of non-gambling, but how the rich people do it. Or if you want to be rich, you have to think like the rich Stun like the rich, act like the rich, sleep, work, and uh, educate yourself like the rich. And the one thing that separates the rich from the simpletons and the sheeple and the easily manipulated uh, jabronis are the financial education that you need does not is not provided for you in government education, right? The government would be a detriment to them if they taught you about money. School and high school, K through 12, does not teach you about money. They teach you how to earn currency and pay high taxes and pay down debt and acquire more useless debt, but they don't teach you about money. When you go to college, unless you specifically pay tons of money 
for certain courses, they will teach you, uh, uh, they'll, they'll teach you how to earn an income and how to pay taxes and uh, how to save a little bit of money or currency, but they won't teach you how money actually works and how rich people uh, use it to their benefit to make the money work for them and they don't work for money, right? Because the teachers don't know anything about money. They're a teacher. They were never a businessman or a businesswoman. They never ran a company, you know? They're not investors. They don't generate cash flow. They earn an income that's taxed at the highest tax bracket and they learn their, they know their few deductions they get. They pay a 40% total tax and they go on their merry way. That's why no matter how much money they make, they're always fucked. Because as soon as they make more money, they go out and buy a nicer house, a, a bigger car, a nicer house, right? A bigger house, a more expensive car, fancy jewelry, more expensive clothes, finding, whining and dining themselves at fancy restaurants that they never did. So they can generate more money via, via a raise or working more hours, but they're getting deeper, deeper in debt and farther and farther behind where they need to be because they don't have an education on money. But what the fuck are you talking about again, Vincenzo? You're rambling on like a lunatic. I don't know what the fuck you're saying. And it's not getting my house back. It's down in rubble because it got burnt down Waco style. I need some goddamn real information, Vincenzo. Not none of this malarkey about the rich and the way money works for you and all this fucking nonsense. How do I get out from under my house? Well, my good man, I've been trying to educate you on this. But you need to buy cash generating assets, right? And if you want to get simple and easy education on this, this is the easiest way I can do this for you. Is you watch these, you listen to these audio books and you'll have a basic understanding and a whole new world on how to generate cash flow, make money working for you, and uh, having a higher standard of life based on a higher education about money, right? It all falls in the line as soon as the light switch is slipped on switched on and this information that's been kept from you is given to you right the easiest books rich dad poor dad start with that it's a three and a half hour audio book listen to it or buy it and read it i like listening to it because it kills time at work in the car etc then the next book down the line book two learn the difference between oh it's not really a book it's his lecture no it's a book learn the difference between real and fake money right and then his third and final book, it's very long. It's a three part, it's like 14 hours. Uh, fake money, fake teachers, and fake assets, right? After you listen to all three of those, you will have a basic understanding on how the rich people think, the tax system, and how it's set up uh, for a certain way to spend and earn money to benefit you the most where you pay virtually no taxes and have a steady uh, cash flow being generated that pays your day-to-day -day and monthly expenses, and then you have extra money that's just being sent or mailed to you or given to you in dividends and interest or rent payments or whatever that you live off of and you acquire more assets with that money. And as you acquire more assets and dividends are being paid and rent, uh, your assets grow, which now your dividends and interest are being higher and higher because your cash account is higher. So it just fee it's a self-feeding machine but you have to first start thinking, living, and acting, and spending like the rich. The rich didn't get rich by getting a job. The rich got rich by starting a business, or if they had a normal income generating job, they took that income and invested nearly all of it. Just uh, all the money they possibly could without, with, with virtually no money left besides food money, right, gas, and basic necessities. They lived in shitholes. They drove shithole cars. They wore shitty clothes. They lived like homeless people while they were building and investing until their cash flow from their investments. After years, sometimes 10, 15 years of investing into what they're investing in, and they finally would meet their goal of their cash flow generated from their assets and their balance sheet was enough to offset their monthly expenses. And then they not only had enough to pay off their monthly expenses, they had enough uh, extra money to start buying these luxury items that they wanted, but could not at the time pay for. So they had to figure out a way to generate more cash flow uh, and increase it in order to pay off these luxury items that they desired and seeked out and wanted, 
right? But they did that after the cash flow was generated to pay for these assets or to pay for these liabilities and luxury items. They, you know, the business paid for it. The money each month being sent in by renters and clients and dividend payments that the businesses they own um, paid for it. That's what the rich do. That's what you all need to start doing. Like, subscribe, and share. Peace and love. Peace and love.